So you have heard of DeFi or decentralized finance, which essentially creates decentralized versions of traditional finance systems where anyone with an internet connection can really receive banking and individuals can earn, lend and borrow assets, have complete control over their finances. But have you heard of ReFi? So what is ReFi? Well, ReFi or regenerative finance is a new financial model that regenerates communities as economic hubs and the health and biodiversity of global ecosystems with its participants wanting to accelerate the development of new planet positive technologies. So SEP, the co-founder of Celo, outlines three vital pillars of ReFi, which are universal access to financial tools, community commerce, and health and biodiversity of global ecosystems. But my partner Celo are real leaders here in the ReFi space. And so to kick off, here are four examples of projects that are building with Celo to use this model. First, we got the Toucan Protocol, which connects the voluntary carbon market, think like more like carbon offsets, to Web3 through the Toucan Bridge, which tokenizes real world carbon credits in exchange for semi-fungible tokenized CO2 tokens. And then we have Impact Market, which launched in 2020 as a decentralized poverty alleviation protocol, which is really one of the biggest UBI or universal basic income projects in the world. And they currently have 44,000 people receiving UBI through Impact Market in over 30 countries around the world. And then Kickstarter, you guys know Kickstarter. Uh, since its founding in 2009, more than $6 billion has been pledged in crowdfunding campaigns on Kickstarter. Now, in its transition to Web3, they'll be opening up a decentralized decentralized protocol to others who want to build for community commerce, and they're building this with Celo. Then there's Flow Carbon, who's the creator of the GNT token, which is backed by corporate grade carbon credits that they bring on chain. It's also providing the infrastructure to help corporations and individuals offset their emissions, and it's completely transparent. So what is Celo? Well, my partner Celo is really the original climate conscious blockchain who launched on Earth Day in 2020, and was the first blockchain designed to be carbon negative from the start. So allocating a percentage of the Celo reserve to carbon credits and other their tokenized natural assets. Cell is committed to the original mission of cryptocurrency, creating the conditions of prosperity around the world, and is quickly becoming a leader in the refi movement. Cell is an EVM compatible layer one blockchain designed to make it accessible and usable by anyone with a smart or mobile phone really anywhere in the world. So with Cello, every mobile phone number can be a wallet address. So with 7.7 .7 billion people on the planet, 2 billion desktops, 6 billion mobile phones, you can really send a payment as easy as a text. As Web3 demands natural capital backed assets, as well as refi assets in general, Celo is working to build a more beautiful and prosperous world built on the principles of community and unique values. So Celo's Climate Collective has proposed transitioning 40% of the Celo reserve to transition to tokenized rainforests and other carbon sequestering assets to support natural capital backed currencies on the Celo platform over the next four years. So it's become increasingly clear that this connected multi-chain ecosystem will create a regenerative economy that's sustainable to transform at scale. So if you're interested in learning more, check out a recap of Celo Connect and subscribe to Celo's YouTube channel to keep up with all things refi. Also head to their website, celo.org.